it would stop. I remember you went and waited for the train to stop on the subway and it fell on top of me once. Or almost did, remember? Where we go? Uh, we gotta go towards uh, Tryon. We gotta go. Towards Tryon. Uh, I don't know what the heck I'm doing, Joe. We gotta go. Left, maybe? I don't know. Let's see go. what the street sign says. It doesn't, I don't see one. This is road closed up that way. Oh. Okay, that is Tryon up there. The road closed. Uh, yeah, they're building something over there. I don't yeah. know what they're doing. Uh, we can't go that way? Oh, uh, I think we can. It's just road closed. I don't know about the sidewalk. Oh, just part of the road. Maybe. We'll have to get on the other side. So we're going up towards Tryon. Okay. They definitely took the midnight diner out. Dang. They moved it. I know. Yeah, they there literally is, moved. There's no street thing here, so we're just going to have to go. Okay. They literally moved the building yeah, to I see a it. trade street. Dang. You know, I don't know how you did. they did that. There's a bunch of grass here where they've been mowing. Yeah. That makes somebody slip and fall. Where they don't think when they do things. Nope. That's too smart. Oh, there's another motorcycle. Yeah, and that's another thing. Might be if an you idiot. Get, if you get... If you get uh, grass into the road, it could make a motorcyclist uh, have an accident. Yep. And they could slide on that. This building has bars and a, and a uh, security thing. Oh, wow. I don't know what it is. It's 206. Oh, I bet it's apartment. Mm. I bet it's apartment. Is this 202? And that was 206. Yeah, I bet it's apartment. And there's even a security gate to the courtyard between the... Yeah. Oh, wow. It's apartment. Man, they, they really got security going on. Security Must be some high pollutant stuff in there. Apparently. Maybe a CIA compound. I'm telling you. I bet this, this is crazy. You need a security thing to get into your front door. Well, I guess to make sure they know you live there. Wow. My thing is this. Now tell me if this makes any sense. What? They've got a security gate and a and a thing where you can key in a number to <laughs> get to the front door. But yet there is a doorbell to ring the front door. You need to be able to get in to ring the front do to ring the doorbell. How crazy is that, Joe? Yeah, it is. You know what? What? Sometimes when they have all that over the top stuff, it's really just for show. I don't know, but I'm telling you, it is high security. They've even got bars on the on the apartments up at the top. Is it a prison? I don't know what it is. I assume it's an apartment building. Really. Because there's no, like, no sign or anything to tell me. Camden, South 
built-in apartment homes. Now that's the building over there, so I don't know if it's the same thing or not, but anyway. Alright, Joe, you want to push it? Yeah. It's okay. a fake one, I think. No, it's not. It don't work. Uh, it don't work. Dang. That's the other locator tone of Okay, it says it's doing the stop thing. Why is Carson and Tryon always having a broken APS? I don't know. We turned that one in last time. We turned it in. Yeah. I remember this intersection. We did. Now, where are we going from here, Joe? Up Tryon, like towards two set, like across 277. Okay, wait a minute. I'm, I'm, I don't know which direction that is. North. Are you talking about uptown? Yeah. Further uptown? Okay. All right. I can do that. That is one of those little. It's got two wheels at the front and one wheel at the back kind of thing car. I don't know what it's called. Tricycle. No, no, it ain't. It's a, it's a car. Oh. But it's, I don't know what it, it's a called. A slingshot. That, that might be what it was. Yeah. It's a hybrid between a motorcycle and a car. Yeah. I wonder if you need a, a license to drive that. You need a special motorcycle license, but a lot of motorcycles ride dirty. What do you mean ride dirty? Without a license. Oh. All right. How am I supposed to hear that? I don't know, but there's cars going and they shouldn't be. Not when you're in the intersection. That's the law. If yep. you're in that intersection at all, they're supposed to stop. Doesn't matter if you're in a little bit of the intersection or whatever. You're supposed to stop. Okay, Joe, I'll let you push this one too. Right in front of you. It's right in front of you. See, this one works. <laughs> oh, wow. Ah, nice. Okay. <laughs> The one that goes across 277. from your dad that I didn't I didn't hear my phone he said I hate to ask but what y'all getting into the yeah. sidewalk is horrible right through here Joe. did you feel that yeah it's like part of it was missing and everything yeah Crazy. so we're staying right on this road here yeah are we headed the right direction because the the next intersection is Moorhead yeah we are okay just making sure well, we're up on the opposite side of the road from where Jinja uh, is. Oh, well, we'll just have to cross the road. Yeah. Where do we cross it at? I don't know. Probably I don't... Close. We'll pro it'd probably be better off crossing it closer to the restaurant. Yeah, but where is the restaurant? I didn't, I don't know. I thought you knew. Uh, it's, it's, I know, it's, it's, uh, it's past Moorhead, but, like, it's in Uptown. Okay. The reason I wanted to get off here is, because I always like the feeling of when you walk from here, over the bridge into Uptown, and you're surrounded by all the tall buildings, you know? Yeah.
What's this on the left? What's what? This on the left. Echoes. Well, it's just part of the sidewalk. And on the corner is something called Queen City Grounds. So I imagine that's a coffee shop. Yep, that's what it is. All right, this is a different thing right in front of you. It's not the arrow. Oh, this is a fake one. I oh. call this a fake PS. All right. Why is it fake? It doesn't work? Because it isn't an actual APS. Like, it's of no use to a blind person. Oh. Well, why is the signal up? Well, I mean, for sighted people, I guess. Yeah. See, I always want to, it's kind of, uh, kind of, oh, there's players. <laughs> Second time we heard that on the streets. Uh, more, sometimes I think, uh, Moorhead is, uh, it, it's questionable whether or not Moorhead is actually uptown. Because one part of it is south of 277, the other part of it is north of it. It's like the dividing line between like so many neighborhoods, but then if you go west Moorhead, like by the stadium, mm -hmm. It's widely considered as uptown. That little place across the street there is called Charlotte Cigar Culture. Yeah, I've heard of it. Only because passing by it. There's a hog. Yep. the beginning of the bridge where the concrete is it says south end on it now yeah. that's across the street not sure what it says on here because i'm not up here yet the uptown sign same thing it's the south end yeah this is the south end sign when you go on the other side of the bridge there's a sign that says uptown you should take a picture with the uptown sign the uptown sign? Yeah, which is up on the other end of the bridge. Okay. Good 
Samaritan Way? I never knew there was a Good Samaritan Way. Well, actually, it used to be called Hill Street, but I didn't even know Hill Street was named after a person until they wasted my money to tell me he was racist. You know, I call that Hill Street. I still call it Hill Street because it has like four names and it's really confusing. Okay, Joe. This is the uptown sign. If yeah. you want to get your picture taken beside of the uptown sign. Let me be able to get the words in there too. Let me that the city probably paid thousands of dollars for. Yeah. I guarantee you I could have designed something a whole lot better. Could I have? Huh? Could I have? Is probably. Have? Probably you could have come up with an idea better than that. What is it? I, I don't even know what how to describe it. It's, it's like... I don't know. I'll have to think about how to describe it. It's goofy looking if you ask me. Goofy like me? No, not quite that goofy. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, Joe, we got a walk sign, so we're going on across. There's another hog. See how it sounds different and it feels different now? I do. Okay, Joe, to your left. <laughs> hey, we're hitting it today. Nah, we better wait. Because it's already counting down. Yeah, that's just you hear? Mm -hmm. In Raleigh, they all talk, and in Raleigh, their count does like. Mm. Mm. It, it's not every second. Now it's done counting down. Mm -hmm. You know how? How? Oh, I'll press it. Yeah, press it, man. See, the APS still says say? West Hill Street. Huh? What did it say? It says wait to cross out Tryon Street at West Hill Street. It still says Hill Street. Oh, okay. They are so outdated. What is? This, the whole system is outdated. Yeah. You got eBay Braille. You got somebody calling it a different street. You got, I mean, it's I don't just, care about eBay Braille. You know I love eBay Braille. Well, I know. But this generation coming up now does UEB. Yeah. Well, this generation, like it might, probably ain't going to read Braille. I hate to say it, but the technology has come so far. And they and side of people use it too that they probably ain't gonna read braille. Okay, Joe, they do have outdoor seats. Wondering if we have to go in first. Yeah, you do have to and go in. Excuse probably. me, can I ask you a question? Do we have to go in first and then come over? Okay. Thank you. Some places you could just go right outside and just sit down and then come to you. Yeah. But that, that's why I asked. <laughs> Alright, Joe, 
gonna say, it's just full hard. Oh. Over 